<laughs> I would never. I, th I think YouTube. I think one of the most cringiest things in the world is YouTubers trying to do music. Uh, it's, oh it's, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> it's the worst, bro. It's the worst. Welcome back, guys. And today we have got a big old mukbang. I know you guys love them, so I thought since we're stuck in lockdown here, uh, me and Harry would jump on the app Stereo, and we're gonna do a muk bang and just chat about loads of different things and tell a few hilarious stories that we have not to mention guys um if you guys want to go ahead and follow me on the app stereo when i get to 20k i'm going to be doing a 1500 pound giveaway um or 2000 dollar giveaway um over on there so yeah go ahead and follow me let's get to 20k enjoy the video guys happy days right we're live all right, so wait, people, if you are li listening, yeah, make sure you send in audio messages. Don't try finesse it and um, and try and join the join the phone call because I ain't picking up. It's just me and Bog, unfortunately. You know what? I feel almost privileged to have you on here, and that's only because you said that you never do podcasts. So this is the closest thing that I'm ever gonna get. Yeah, I'm not. I'm, this isn't a podcast though. This is more of a. It's like a call in. This is more talk show, I'd say. I'd argue. Yeah, no, that's very fair. We got a caller on line one. <laughs> How long do you think you two will be living together for? <gasps> Ooh. 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 The good news is that we are, we've got at least another year together. Yeah, we, we've said we're going we're gonna to try and extend her out for a year. But then after that, it could be the end. Mate, how long have we lived together for now? In November. It will be seven years. No way. Oh my God. I've, you spent <laughs> seven years of your life living with me. Oh that my is tragic. God. Who would win in a fight between you two? Whoa. Whoa. Oh Whoa. my God. Harry, Harry would absolutely bad to me. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. <laughs> ah! 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 <laughs> you weigh so much now. But here's what I will say, Harold. I reckon in a, in a boxing fight, I might win on points, okay? But I reckon mm -hmm. in any other scenario, I reckon I get absolutely battered. <laughs> you know what? This app, my God. I, had, I, I, I didn't really know what to expect with it, but I'm having a great time on this app. Good old stereo, mate. What is the funniest story that's happened to you while drunk? Oh, mate. I've, the funniest time I remember I've been drunk is probably Mykonos. But I yeah, don't know about a specific is... thing that's happened. Like, uh... So what happened was I, I went on a night out. Harry, I think you might have been at home in Guernsey, actually. I was so peppered. I got back to the house. Me and a few of my mates got back. I was like, guys, I don't have the key to my house. I can't get into the house. What we had to do was I, I got like propelled by like, you know, you put your hands into lock them and then you jump on it and someone pushes you, you up. I, I managed to latch onto the balcony. I pulled myself onto the balcony and then I had to, we had to bring all the other boys up. I don't know why we did that because all it would take is one person to get in and you can open the front door. But we, we all thought we were bloody mission impossible. We're getting here, we squeezed through the tiniest window that Harry had left open in his uh, bedroom window. <laughs> From no. them, uh, we, we all get in. I sit down, I go, whoa, what an ordeal. And as I sit down, I go, oh, fuck, that's uncomfy. What's on the chair? And then I reach in my back pocket, pulled out the keys. Man, I'd have been fuming disaster. at you. I'd be Mate. so fuming after all that. What's your favorite Sidemen video being to um, film? Obviously, Carl's being a part of some. So what's your favorite that you've done together? Um, I, think might have the same, I think we have the same answer here, probably. All right, we'll say it on three. Ready? All right. One, yeah. two, three. The holiday. Sidemen holiday. That's my favorite Sidemen video of all time, I think, overall. Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you what, a free holiday <laughs> goes down a great. <laughs> Harold, I think we do owe the people an explanation because the video cuts off just before we go on an absolute tear of a night out. Well, it's time for part three, isn't it? Get your shoes on. Get your shoes on. Because we're going out. Park we're on a trip. Wait, we're, we're going out, bro. Going out. Bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> this, is a, this is a funny drunk story. This is what okay. happened, okay? And now, now, please understand, guys. I was so peppered. We've been drinking all day on the yacht. We um, had, to be fair. It was, it was a long slog up to that point. I just, I need to say this beforehand. Like, never act like this on a night out. Like, it was so cringe. Now that I think back and I just think this is so cringy. But anyway, <laughs> some guy was lying down at his table. Like, straight up lying down. And I made mm -hmm. a comment to him. I was there, I went to him and I was like, why are you lying down at your table? 
I don't know why I, I wanted to know, but I asked him. And then he just started switching at me. He was there just mm -hmm. like, it's none of your business. I paid for the table with my money, blah, 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 like this. And I was like, which I'll is fair, it. which is fair, which is fair. Yeah, like, yeah, that's what I'm saying, <laughs> fair enough. But, um, and it, you know, if it wasn't peppered, I'd have just walked away and been like, right, okay, that guy's obviously on stuff. But instead I stood there and I said, you don't need to speak to me like, you know what I mean? Like, I just started oh, going back and no. forth with it. It was so bad. And eventually Bouncer came over to me and he was like, can you please leave? This area. And I was like, no, nah, me and my, we're talking. And then it just went from there. And then eventually mm -hmm. he, he must have just realized how peppered I was and it was just embarrassing for me. And so he dragged mm. me out. Obviously, Kalix came to the rescue. He's well, tried to. Over. He tried to. Yeah. Um, I've got a question for Harry. Do you think you'd make any other music because, you know, diss track season's over and stuff? I don't think personally it's for me. I, I, <laughs> I would never. I, th I think YouTube. I think one of the cringiest things in the world is YouTube is trying to do music. Uh, it's, oh it's, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> it's the worst, bro. It's the worst. It is. People, so many people think that they can do. It. I don't know what it is. I don't know what people gives people the confidence to think just because they're good at something else they can do music. But most ninety nine percent of it is stinky. Uh, obviously, some people are decent at it, but no, it's not. It's not for me. It's not for me. I think there's a lot more people that think they're better than they actually are at. Um, oh, it's at oh, making bro. music. It's. Yeah, I don't, I don't know who is it that just like that you're, if you're close to someone that's doing that, just tell them, yo, I don't think this is it. <laughs> you can't tell your boy, you can't let you can't let him put it out. <laughs> you can't, you can't do it. I was just wondering, I know you two live together. Is there any pet peeve that annoys oh. maybe one or the other of you? Is there anything that the other person does that might annoy you? Oh. Anything at all? I don't have a pet peeve, but I have a moment. That I'm like, wow, this, 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 wow. Oh, actually, I think distressed. I know what you're gonna say. Do you? Yeah. What, what, what do you think it is? Say it, and I'll, I'll tell you. The, right the fish moment. The fish. The moment. fish moment. Oh, the no. fish moment. This is. Outrageous. I'm so sorry. I literally. This I, is yeah. Outrageous. I literally looking back on that. Looking back at that, I can only apologise. I was fresh off the boat from Guernsey. Live, try to live with these new, these new Donnies in London. I'm like, oh, oh this will be this is a bit nerve wracking. I'm sure I'll have a nice time. They seem like nice guys. I've been there for maybe, I don't know, six months or so. Him, him Joe Sugg and JJ are up in JJ's penthouse. I'm trying to get some kip. And then they burst in with a raw fish and just like smush the raw fish in my face and all over my bed. What up, Dino? <laughs> My bed fucking stinks. My face stinks. I'm just bamboozled by this whole situation. Like, what's going on? I was close to tears. I don't know what just happened. Big Joe Sog as well. He's a big deal. He's just f fucking smacked me in the face with a fish. Me, Steve. Steve, the fish. Oh, that's and, um, yeah, it, it made your, your room smell of fish for like a week. What's your favorite birthday memory? Ooh. 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 When we were back at the old house, I had that surprise party. And like, so I didn't know it was happening. Yeah. My, my ex like set it up and I basically like left to go for a meal with her. And then while I was ha having this meal, everyone came to the house and when I came back and was like, well, surprise. I never had a surprise party before. So it was, uh, it yeah. was lovely. However, I uh -oh. did spoil it because we had, we had ring the doorbell thing. And so I'm oh. sitting eating dinner <laughs> and the ring app just keeps popping off, popping off. I'm like, I thought maybe a couple of things. And then, but literally like 20 times in like 20 minutes, the thing's gone. I'm like, so either someone's like moving in and out or something's up here. So, but I, I, I pushed it to the back of my mind, but I had an yeah. inkling that something had happened because the ring was just having a, having a, having just a field day. But, um, yeah, oh, but that, man, that, that is really such fun. a classic way to like spoil something. My question is, who out of the Sidemen boys do you reckon would be able to survive the longest in a zombie apocalypse? Love you both, good night. Mm. Ooh. I know who I'm gonna say. Josh, just of uh, Josh or Vic, I just based on Vic. ingenuity. I was gonna say Vic. He's equipped to to battle anything of the uh, that the outdoors mm. can throw him. Whereas I feel like Josh, Josh is a little too comfy sitting at home live streaming for 24 hours. That is true. You know, Vic, Vic's been out and about. Vic likes an adventure. I was just wondering, what is both of your worst dates you've ever been on? Ooh. Oh no, oh no. Oh my god, wait, how about it? Can we, can we, can we tell this one? Uh, I, don't, I don't really want to, no. 
<laughs> it's so good. Oh, People are going to be fuming that we, you haven't said that story. Yeah, I'm sorry, lads. I'm sorry. You're, if you meet me in person, I'll tell you the story. But I don't want to say. I don't want to put it out there. He's looking dickhead. <laughs> Do you guys have a favorite conspiracy theory that you're really interested in? If so, what is it? Whoa. Do you know the salmon? You know the salmon, but it's pink. You know it's not actually pink. They just put dye in it. Apparently that's a conspiracy. No, they don't. No they way. Do. They do. They do. They, it doesn't. It comes out like grey, and they make, they dye it to make it pink. There's the Rothschild uh, conspiracy as well. I love that one. That the yeah. People, that, that so, is, I, that's a conspiracy. That's probably that's not even like. That's just like people that people people, people run the world that aren't even like that we don't even know who they are. Like like the whole like Jeff yeah. Bezos of being the richest people in the world is not true. Like those people that yeah. are just like that conspiracy is all about a family that just essentially run the world run the world yeah we we'll want to get on the wrong side of them put it that way uh, this is more of a question for harry but um are you okay because your spotify is looking kind of sus recently you know <laughs> oh, not again what's wrong with my spotify at the moment oh this is terrible you were just judging me for my spotify it's not even bad Oh my god, no, I know what it is. I know what it is. So there's a song. <laughs> so here's some of the songs I'm listening to at the moment. Believe, which is Do You Believe in Love of the Love, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Need You the Most by the, the Kid Leroy, which is just like, uh, the, oh, I no. need you the most. Oh, no. There's one called yeah. You Broke Me First. Um, oh my called, god, like, Harold, this is a <laughs> depression playlist. The one that's doing me in is the Anne Marie song, which is called Fuck I'm Lonely. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I, I wonder why you take three showers a day and it, it must just be to mask the crying, the constant crying. <laughs> Bro. Anyways, there we go. How, how far through do, uh, your sushi did you make it? Dude, I'm, I've made a valiant effort, but I am feeling very full. But we are both trying to put on some pounds right now, so I will finish this. I'll get to yeah, the bottom we of are. it. We, we, we are on our, our, on our weight gain journey. And even after this, mm -hmm. I might go slap a little mass gainer in the belly. But appreciate, appreciate you jumping on stereo with me, fella. Mate, hold, hold tight to stereo guy and shout out to there's been over a thousand of you guys just chilling in here listening to me and Harold just waffle um, So yeah, big up everyone and even bigger shout out to everybody that sent through a voice message You guys had some good questions and make sure yeah. you follow oh. me and Cal Freezy click the follow button Yes, all right guys. Well, it's been an absolute pleasure Bogo once again. You have uh, brought the vibes and the energies So anytime my friend anytime anytime Laters